I'm Virgil Hammonds, RSU2 superintendent, and what you're uh, witnessing today is uh, all of our senior graduates that are uh, presenting their what we call their capstone project. And this is a project that they select themselves. Um, it's basically a project that they're passionate about, that they want to see through, that they want to see to completion. And really, it's an opportunity for them to prove all of the knowledge and skills that they've acquired while at Halldale High School. Um, and ultimately culminating in, a, in something that potentially they can pursue in the future. Yeah, a, a big part of actually the process starts as you're seeing today with our middle school kids already starting to gather some ideas of what are things that may engage them now that they may want to pursue and, and um, thoroughly research and study in the, in the future. I, I knew I would have to do capstone in middle school, probably sixth or seventh grade, uh, coming to this exhibition and seeing all of the possibilities I could do. And so I've known for a while and I've tried to prepare myself with thinking ahead of time topics I'd want to do. In the learner-centered model, we want kids to apply the content to a, to a subject matter that's meaningful to them every single day, not just in their senior year. And for my capstone project, I did animal adoption. And for my field work, I organized a dog speed dating event for the Kennebec Valley Humane Society. Well, what we're feeling is that it's not just about doing school anymore. It's about really engaging kids in what's in projects that are meaningful to them, not necessarily to the school district or the teacher that sits before them. Really, the the kids initially they struggle with the fact what what am, what I, what do I want to do? What do I want to tackle? What goals do I have for myself? And so they struggle through the planning process, much like us as adults do, as we struggle through a project. The whole idea around student-centered learning is to really engage kids in something that is meaningful to them. And so when they step into the capstone class, it's really about asking them, what, what are you passionate about? And how can you apply all the content that you've learned over the last four years in a project that's meaningful to you? I realized how much I needed to be self-reliant. And it was really up to me to make my own deadlines and to be assertive in finding my expert mentor. Um, and getting what I wanted done and getting the results I wanted. And I learned I actually really enjoyed organizing events. So that was fun because it made it a lot more enjoyable. When it comes to this point in the year where they're presenting their, their culminating project, it's amazing to just see the pride and, and the confidence that they exude when they're, when they're making their presentations.